habits to always improve, but never to replace. And I think, you know, it's a game for humans, it is a game. And we must not ever lose sight of the fact that it is a game. And I'd love technology to be continue to be used and it has a place. And that, that box, if you like, that Pandora's box has been opened. You will never go back to no technology. And like every part of life, we should embrace it and see how it adds value. And always, as technology improves, we should always stop and reflect and work out, are we using it the right way, the best way? And make sure that we just don't use it for the sake of using it. And never forget that it's about people too. You know, and, um, for me and the umpires, it, it, it's, a, it's a challenge as well. You know, the, the players, um, you know, aren't being replaced by technology. We don't want the umpires to be replaced by technology as well. But technology needs to be right. It needs to be uh, incorporated, as I said, to add value. But don't just accept it for the sake of accepting it. Because all you might do is maybe change one set of problems and replace them with a different set of problems. If that makes sense. In the first video, we saw the decision of Mahindra Singh Dhoni. Like, uh, decision of Mahindra Singh Dhoni, the match turning the decision. Uh, in the first video, do you think Ampere should have been more uh, careful about taking the... You're, a, you're an advantage on me of that question because I was on a plane while that match was happening. <laughs> So I didn't see the decision or the event that you're talking about, I'm sorry. Uh, the, the thing happened like uh, the ball pitch outside the leg zone and the background of uh, the field. And the uh, umpire given up. So the match turned.